by the authority vested in me by the District of Columbia, I now proclaim you to be legally married. Today marked the first day same-sex couples in Washington, D.C. could wed. Three couples that were the first to apply for a license last week are now among the first to be legally married. Our gratitude to the mayor, the city council, and the citizens for being willing to open the door to say it really is marriage equality for all. The weddings were held at the Human Rights Campaign and witnessed by a small gathering of invited guests. Rocky Galloway and Reggie Stanley took the plunge, joined by their two young daughters. I present to you the Stanley Galloway family. We feel that our family with our twin daughters is protected and secure and that love really uh, does shine and, uh, and does have its day as, uh, as a just one. D.C. joins five other states recognizing gay marriage, which is also great news for wedding vendors. And Washington, D.C. opening up to it is huge. You know, not only for the couples themselves getting married, but also for, for the industry, for the event planning industry. Jody Mararu has been in the event planning business for over 20 years and is already seeing a spike in business. You know, while before it was commitment ceremonies, I think people felt a little less compelled to throw celebrations on a grander scale. One study predicts gay marriage could bring an economic boost of more than $52 million to the city. Lila Ibrahim, The Associated Press.